I'm Sir Tap Tap, and welcome to Let's Play Yodoma Globula. Now, before we get started, I want to show you a couple of little things here. First thing is, this is Sir Tap Tap subreddit, and um, it's not super active just yet. But hey, I kind of I tidy things up. I put there's there's a me in the sidebar. There's a little pretty background. There's some rules such as don't be a jerk and be on topic. So you know, <laughs> pretty basic rules. But hey, got to start somewhere. Um, and um, I got a recommendation of the subreddit, and I figured, you know, in honor of that, why not play that game? Also, that game was already in my recommended, um, or my to-review list on Itch.io, so I'm going to check it out. Thanks, Rested Waves, for reminding me, though. Um, so, okay, <laughs> this is... This is going great! Um, this, this is... If you wondered why I don't usually play... Okay. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, now the mouse is working. Okay, crisis averted. Um, if you wonder why I usually wait for fan games and other such projects, I usually, you know, wait for a 1.0 release. Um, this is a pretty good example of why. Um, but hey, it's working now. It's acknowledged that this is a work in progress. So, teleport. F to O. Oh, Captain, we're tilting. Teleport. Where are we teleporting now? Oh! Ew! Oh! Ew! Gross. We're like inside a thing. F. Go, go. Move the. Oh, I don't like that sound at all. Oh, ew. We're in the meat zone! Oh, that is definitely the meat zone. Oh. oh That's one of the meatier meat zones that I've ever seen. It's like a meteor of meat! I like this though. This is really cool. Ah. Performance is a little screwy. I should probably set the frame rate cap to not 2200 FPS. Because my display does not do that. Still dealing with a plebe tier um, 60 FPS monitor. I'm inside the wall. Get get away from the wall sphincters. I don't like those. I do not appreciate the wall. Oh, I lost. I left the, uh, the the piloting seat somehow. Okay. Let's, let's see what's at the top of this. It's kind of vaginal up here. I'm not sure I can show this on YouTube. I don't know if this that, that might be too much. There's only this big rock here. It's a little weird. Uh, let's teleport. This is this is. We're gonna get banned from YouTube if we stay here too long. Hey, this is this is where we just were. I don't like the meat sounds. <laughs> Can we not have the meat sounds? Maybe. Part four, part five, part zero. Okay. All right, there's too many meat sounds here. I don't like this. I'm scared. No, this is just back. Okay, there's only two teleport points apparently. Whatever. I can deal with that. Let's go. Man, this place feels almost Giger-esque. I guess it's just the silver and the grossness, and the meat noises. The meat noises help. Just in the small little details everywhere. Geiger. Wait, no, Ge it is Geiger. I remember that. He um, specifically did not like what the people pronounced his name like the uh, like the Geiger counter, so it is Geiger. Fun fact. So why are there, f there, there seems to be four parts, whatever that means, but um, I don't know how we can transport to the other parts. There's some runes down there. I love fractals, by the way. If you don't know what a fractal is, um, please look it up on like Wikipedia or something. They're um, they fascinated me as a kid. They're still really cool. I read some very big mathematics and physics books about about um, fractals and chaos theory and all that crap. As uh, as an edgy eighth grader, it's really cool stuff. This is. It's like a big looming monster. I know it's just more meat space, but uh, it's still pretty cool. I think we're caught on the bottom or something. Oh, I don't like that sound. Is that just the local ambience? I can't tell if that is way more distant than I think it is, or if this boat is not working properly. I think it. Is, I think it just is really distant. Is it like a speedboat option? Is there a 
speed x-ray radar minimap oh thanks <laughs> good 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 thanks parallel world visor shows the world you're going to be teleported to oh no that is cool now let's talk about parallel universes okay so the teleport depends on where you are oh no it's just meat zone again yeah we just telefragged some of this meat so we are inside the meat let's take a little visit though let's take a visit through the meat um this is a terrible idea this was a very bad no good at all idea let's um let's use some whole blaster here uh oh that sounds bad that sounds really bad. Okay, I think there's limited hole blast per second. Okay, I'm gonna stop using the hole blaster right now. Oh, there is a descent. Control is descent. Okay. Yeah, let's get out of the meat zone. I don't like the meat zone. I do like those tendrils that I... We are stuck in the meat zone! Good news is there's some other, there's some free meat over here. I like how you can't... I like the string meat though. Look at that. That's some interesting meat. So I wonder, is this pre. Uh, this is presumably pre generated because every time I open it, at least, it's been. Um, how, do I, how do I change the. Uh, it won't turn. Kind of stuck. Turn around, turn, turn. Okay, it's just, it, it's boat controls. It's, it's not a graceful beast. I can tell you that much. Um, it is one of the least graceful beasts. Oh god. Oh no. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's real bad. Well, into the meat we go. The fractal meat. There's a lot of meat in here. We'll see if we can teleport somewhere. Oh. Oh, no. Without the boat, we cannot teleport. So is there any... Swap hands. Select control. Wait, can you have two items? Huh. All right, we have lost the boat. Um, I, I, we only seem to be able to go to the two dimensions. Oh, that's pretty cool. This is just a really big one of those meat spirals, isn't it? Whoa. It's a big ass room, huh? Um, I think we're gonna try to find the bottom of this meat crevice. And um, at that point, we'll probably call it a video because I, I we have lost the boat and we cannot teleport anymore. It's really cool though, it's a little, little samey with the um, I'm inside the meat now. Like, I guess each dimension just has kind of one or a few textures. But I'm not really sure what the dimensional thing is, the deal is with that. I'm just gonna kind of write that off as this being early. And all. Because it, it is really cool and seemingly infinite. It's kind of the deal about fractals, right? And repetition, I mean, repetition is, that's kind of how fractals work. So, I mean, um, I'm not too surprised by that either. But, um, obviously there's different fractals that you can generate. Um, I'm just kind of surprised that the teleport only ever seemed to... Now, see, this is, well, it's a little different. So, we're, are we inside the meat? Oh, here we go. Some some lighting differences, at least. See, even just lighting can, can definitely make it feel different. See, we're getting a lot of the same shapes, but uh, the lighting is different, which is really cool. Now plug this into Subnautica and fill this with like water and like squid sharks. That's that's a goddamn game and a half. By the way, is there a roadmap? When, when is Subnautica Below Zero gonna be like completely done? Cause like, I wanna play it, but I don't wanna spoil too much by like playing incomplete versions and stuff. Um, I would rather just play the full version. I did play, I did one stream of the uh, early stuff. I'm just gonna blast some holes. 
Why is there a cooldown on the whole gun now? I don't like that. See, I, especially I don't like the noise especially. The noise is... <laughs> why, why do you have to punish me for shooting holes by... by noise make? The cruelest punishment. Alright, now I'm stuck in the meat. I think... Alright, you know what? We'll do a new game and see if anything is different. This there's a radio. There's like a radio dish. Let's let's check out the radio dish real quick, and we will um, we'll call it a video there. Um, I'll probably check this out when it's like released or if there's like a lot more content. This is definitely cool, but def we're definitely also seeing some of the beta ness of it. All right, what is this bizwax? I think it's just like a. Th I think it's just a thing. I don't think there's any like practicality to that. What is? Is that an indicator of a different world that we can get to? Maybe. X-ray radar mini map. Okay, okay, we got we got double tools now. Strange. I don't fully understand this x-ray radar minimap thing. And now it stopped working suddenly. We seem to be just on the cusp of whatever this is. Because it's disappearing as we try to approach. So yeah, this tool is useless and I'm going to use the parallel world visor instead. That, does that look like meat space? That looks like a different world than meat space. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. According to the map, there was like five different worlds. And that looks kind of meat spacey. We'll see. It certainly sounds like meat. But maybe that's just the retracting walls sound in this game. It looks pretty meat space. I'm not gonna lie. I seem to be having serious difficulty operating in this world. I don't want to live in this world. I think this is a different meat zone, at least. It doesn't have quite the same characteristics. Alright, let's just fall down in the meat zone. This is... This seems to be a different world, and now we're doomed. Save me, whole blaster. Oh, hey, it kind of worked. Interesting. I see definitely some meat zone-ness to it. Oh! Boop! No, that was the meat zone! We were in the meat zone all along! We were just in a different part of it. Yeah, that's definitely the meat zone. How did we never fall out of the meat zone before, though? I went... Maybe it was a different meat zone. We went really far down. That looks like Atmos from um, Final Fantasy IX. Well, this is the second time this week that I've recorded a video where I just end of me falling out of bounds. Forever. Such a uniquely video gamey thing, too, isn't it? Well... I'm so tap tap. This is Yodoma globula. It's very globular. I, gu I guess that's the reason for the name. It's very globular in nature. Let's see. Let's see where the where we are in the other dimension. Wait, is that not? No, 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 no that's the map. No, wait, no. This is the map. This is the parallel world visor. The parallel world visor. I guess we're just so far down that every world looks the same. Oh. Wait, am I actually... No, I'm I'm still falling, it just doesn't move anymore. It's just, I guess I'm that far away. Or maybe it's receding. I think it's receding very slowly. I don't know. Anyway, that's Yodoma Globula. That was fun. Um, definitely feels like there could be a bit more variation, like select. Let me select which world to go to or something, but... Um, 
I mean, by, by its nature, it doesn't really have too much quote-unquote gameplay yet. It's just kind of looking around in the mysterious wilderness. But uh, it's still pretty cool. Thanks for the recommendation. I'm glad I finally checked it out. Um, I will be very interested to see what the final version looks like.